I'm back with another K-pop haul just because, you know, I love being hopelessly multi-fandom and torching my bank account. This time I just have like a bunch of collection fillers and like some exciting things. So let's just get on with it. I bought these two albums from eBay and they came relatively fast so I was impressed. But first I got Stray Kids and then another 17 and then... I also have two albums that I lost the original packaging for. I don't have anything to open, but I also have another Street Kids Mural and 101 album. Let me just organize everything into the respective groups. Okay, so first I'm going to start off with 101. So here I got the Nothing Without You album. At first, I wasn't sure whether or not I wanted this album in my collection, but after like much thinking and watching other unboxings of it, I decided that like I should get it. I know it's late, but I finally got this album and it is the one version. Um, I just liked this photo shoot better because I thought the Wana version, like the, the blurry photo shoot just wasn't my vibe. In this album, you get one random member calendar, Thing, and I got Dehui and I got July which is my birthday month so that's cool and there's his message his handwriting is so cute oh my god I love him so much and also I got the Quenlin standee he looks so tall oh my god he is so tall and then for my clear card I got Tune and I'm so happy. He's such a little baby. I love him. And then here's the golden ticket that doesn't even matter anymore. Like, the code doesn't even matter anymore. And then it also comes with this tiny photo book and a lyric uh, pamphlet kind of card thing. The colors are honestly so pretty. Like, and this is really good quality paper, too. <laughs> and for the photo book, oh my god. Honestly, let's be real here. The reason I got this album was for these pictures. Like, look how good Minyani looks. This photo shoot is pretty iconic. Oh my god, his smile. I can't. Anyway, like, all the pictures are so cute. I feel like all the members just look really soft and i like it next is my 17 album you made my dawn i honestly am really not sure what version this is i forget i know it's like the first version for the lenticular i got mingyu which is my bias and i like screamed when i first <laughs> flipped the album open. The album packaging for You Made My Dawn is the same as You Make My Day and I like the consistency like I think they're doing some sort of trilogy so it's cute it's compact you know it's easy to store so I'm all for it but in the front you get this like lyric booklet thing and then the photo book is so pretty actually like this is my favorite. I wasn't the biggest fan of all of the photo shoots when the teasers first came out but this photo shoot by far is my favorite um because of these pictures right here like the lighting just like the ambience everything is so good and like it makes all the members look so good and i'm just a fan of like blue tone photo shoots i guess but for my cards of course you get this sticker and then I got Joshua, and there's nothing on the back, but, and then Woozy, and then for my fold-out mini poster, I got Hoshi, a dancing legend, honestly, oh my god. I recently just watched the KCON New York uh, live stream because I wasn't able to make it this year, and I died when Seventeen came on, like, they... They did so well, and they shook that stage up. Next, we have my Stray Kids album. So I pre-ordered both of these. I got the pre-order um, 
sticker and I got 10 <laughs> so my bias says hey but they're cute I don't know what I'm gonna do with this huge sticker but it's nice to have and then here is the album itself so the special editions have this slip cover on them so the album itself looks like this it's just all black and here's like the inside of the album and then the back is basically the same so there it is um this title track shook me like i was n honestly like okay stray kids music is really good but i was not expecting like a whole edm dance track and i loved it so much like the beat drop is everything wow it just shook me to the ground and i wouldn't have expected anything less from stray kids so this photo book is gorgeous um you got the big huge photos honestly i'm starting to get tired of this huge packaging like i hope jyp will transition to something else even though i know this cap packaging is the most convenient but anyway for my random page i got minho his gaze is just so cute oh the only good thing about these large pages as i have said before in my previous unboxings is like the fact that the pictures are so big and beautiful but other than that it just takes up a lot of space as a collector but you know it's just something you gotta deal with and this album literally came with so many cards like jam-packed with cards this was like a pretty big unit um I got Ujin, Hyunjin, Felix, Chang Bini Bini Bin, <laughs> and Chan. So they look pretty cute. Here we go, guys. Okay, so for all my cards, I got Felix. <laughs> Chi Song. Hyunjin. Sumini. And yeah. Four cards in one album, wow. Photo card collectors are quaking, casual album buyers are loving it. <laughs> Next off, we have Yellow Wood. So I also pre-ordered this and got the um, limited edition version. I got this little freebie Stray Kids card, which is cute. And then also the pre-order benefits. So in here we have Oh gosh, um, this, I literally have no clue what this is, like, no clue at all, I don't know, but I got Felix, and I don't know what this, like, perforated part is for, but someone help, Felix looks so good, wow, when does he not look good though, he's so attractive, and then for this postcard, I got Changbin, with, like, the previous limited edition, um, you have this slip cover, and it's really cool how they like differentiate between the textures of the paper because this is very granulated, and then this is smooth. I'm so happy that they released their mixtapes in a special album because I've been listening to them on the CDs and stuff, and mixtape number one is by far my favorite. <laughs> so here's what the album looks like without the slip cover. And the spine just says yellow wood. And so, you know, got their typical packaging. And for my random member, I got Sumin, of course. He loves me, honestly. I always get him in every single al album, no matter what. The photo book, gorgeous, stunning, amazing. This photo shoot does not disappoint. Their photo shoots all are really, really good, and I really like them, no matter how simple some of them may be. Like, they just all look so stunning. Like, this really is an all-visual group. <laughs> for my extras, JYP does not disappoint once again. Okay, first of all, there's this huge pack of goodies. I think this is, like, limited edition album version only. So, of course, you get... Your stickers, love that. And then for cards, uh, you get three unit cards. There's this one with Ujin, Minho, and Chisong. And then this one with Chongyi, Seungmin, and Chan. 
and then this one with Chanbin, Hyunjin, and Felix. So this is all at like the set of their MV, I believe. Side effects shook me so hard. They went for this like different EDM vibe, if you get what I mean. It's kind of like more like a nightclub rager mode. I imagine the extreme flickering strobe lights, you know what I mean? For my actual photo cards, I got the Magne Tonini. Another Tonini, full body. And then Hyunjin, of course. So there are my three cards and that was all for my album. I just have one more package to show you guys and I'm so excited for it. Here it is. Um, it is from K-pop Town. It's my second time ordering from them and they did a pretty good job this time as well. So I definitely recommend them. Um, and so we open this up for a bunch of airbags and inside is my newest light stick. Oh, oh my goodness. Uh, the top falls off very easily. So you gotta be careful to those who are planning to get it. But here she is. Oh my God. It's legitimately like the prettiest light stick I've ever seen in my life. Might be biased. I am biased, <laughs> but okay. Y'all aren't ready. Look how beautiful it is. Oh my goodness. Stunning, gorgeous, amazing. I will have a full unboxing of this light stick in detail with all like the light modes and stuff to show you guys. Probably to be realistic in like a month or so because I like to wait a long time to post my videos because I don't have much content ever because you know, I can't spend money every single week buying albums. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul i know it wasn't like the biggest haul but i guess it wasn't the smallest either and it was just buying you know continuously some more filler things just to fill up my collection and fill in any missing gaps so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you soon with my in-depth newest light stick unboxing bye